it is only necessary to make war with five things. With the maladies of the body, the ignorances of the mind, with the passions of the body, with the seditions of the city and the discord of families. Time is the soul of this world. Reason is immortal, all else mortal. Even as truth, does error have its lovers? Above the cloud with its shadow is the star with its light. Above all things, reverence thyself. Do not go to bed until you have gone over the day three times in your mind. What wrong did I do? What good did I accomplish? And what did I forget to do? Friends are as companions on the journey who ought to aid each other to preserve in the road to a happier life. A fool is known by his speech and a wise man by his silence. Choose rather to be strong of soul than strong of body. Educate the children and it won't be necessary to punish the men. Above all things, respect yourself. Don't try to cover your mistakes with false words. Rather, correct your mistakes with examination. Sobriety is the strength of the soul, for it preserves its reason unclouded by passion. As soon as laws are necessary for men, they are no longer fit for freedom. Silence is better than unmeaning words. Concern should drive us into action and not into depression. Rest satisfied with doing well and leave others to talk of you as they please. The oldest, shortest words, yes and no, are those which require the most thought. We ought so to behave to one another as to avoid making enemies of our friends, and at the same time to make friends of our enemies. Choose always the way that seems the best, however rough it may be. Custom will soon render it easy and agreeable. Friends are as companions on a journey who ought to aid each other to persevere on the road to a happier life. Most men and women, by birth or nature, lack the means to advance in wealth and power, but all have the ability to advance in knowledge. Learn silence. With the quiet serenity of a meditative mind, listen, absorb, transcribe, and transform. Do not say a little in many words, but a great deal in a few. Number is the ruler of forms and ideas, and the cause of gods and demons.
Number was the substance of all things. Number rules the universe. Geometry is knowledge of the eternally existent. There is geometry in the humming of the strings. There is music in the spacing of the spheres. Salt is born of the purest parents, the sun and the sea. The experience of life in a finite, limited body is specifically for the purpose of discovering and manifesting supernatural existence. Learn to be silent. Let your quiet mind listen and absorb. Man know thyself, then thou shalt know the universe and God. In anger, we should refrain both from speech and action. Concern should drive us into action and not into a depression. No man is free who cannot control himself. No one is free who has not obtained the empire of himself. No man is free who cannot command himself. If there be light, then there is darkness. If cold, heat. If height, depth. If solid, fluid. If hard, soft. If rough, smooth. If calm, tempest. If prosperity, adversity. If life, death. Let exercise alternate with rest. It is better to be silent than to dispute with the ignorant. The wise man should be prepared for everything that does not lie within his control. Rest satisfied with doing well and leave others to talk of you as they please. Above the cloud, with its shadow is the star with its light. Above all things, reverence thyself. Some are slaves of ambition or money but others are interested in understanding life itself. These give themselves the name of philosophers, and they value the contemplation and discovery of nature beyond all other pursuits. Each celestial body, in fact, and every atom produces a particular sound on an account of its movement, its rhythm or vibration. All these sounds and vibrations from a universal harmony in which each element, while having its own function and character, contributes to the whole. Friendship is one soul in two bodies. The stars in the heavens sing a music if we only had ears to hear. Don't try to cover your mistakes with false word. Rather, correct your mistakes with examination. There is a good principle which created order, light, and man, and an evil principle which created chaos, darkness, and a woman. Alas, what wickedness to swallow flesh into our own flesh, to fatten our greedy bodies by cramming in other bodies, 
to have one living creature fed by the death of another. Wisdom, thoroughly learned, will never be forgotten. The soul of a man is divided into three parts, intelligence, reason, and passion. Intelligence and passion are possessed by other animals, but reason by man alone. Lust weakens the body and mind. Truth is so great a perfection that if God would render himself visible to men, he would choose light for his body and truth for his soul. Speak not nor act before thou hast reflected. A man is never as big as when he is on his knees to help a child. As long as men massacre animals, they will kill each other. Indeed, he who sows the seeds of murder and pain cannot reap the joy of love. Anger begins in folly and ends in repentance. Educate the children, and it won't be necessary to punish the men. We come from God, as the tree from the root and the stream from the spring. That's why we should always be in contact with him, as the trunk from the root, because the stream dries up when it is separated from the spring, and the tree dies when it is uprooted. If you have a wounded heart, touch it as little as you would an injured eye. There are only two remedies for the suffering of the soul, hope and patience. Hate and fear breed a poison in the blood, which if continued affects eyes, ears, nose and the organs of digestion. Therefore, it is not wise to hear and remember the unkind things others might say about you. He who knoweth not what he ought to know is a brute beast among men. He that knoweth no more than he hath need of is a man among brute beasts, and he that knoweth all that may be known is as a god among men.